Is this going to work? Okay, I need this over here. Bam. All right. We may not be playing this game tonight. We will see, though. Uh, uh, we'll see, though. Because I have to be so far back. I have to be so far back. Okay, I hope this works. Otherwise, maybe Wii games are just out of the question, which would be sad. Because I like Wii games. Aha! I have it. And I can see chat kind of. Okay. okay, it wants to be over there. Slightly. Trying. Okay, here we go. And it. Here. All great. I'm still failing to fix my sensor bar. That is the. Here? Can you guys even hear me? I don't know if there's anyone actually in the chat right now, but this is this is ridiculous. Uh, but it works. I can play Resident Evil this way, kinda sorta. Kinda sorta. Not the greatest. Por acero! Avisar a los demás! Stick with me! I don't want to play this game, guys. What did you do? I'm really interested in what
Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Hunnigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Thanks. What up? Good. I didn't hear you. You asked for that earlier, I did not hear you. No. Ah, Alright, I've already no. been through this part of the game. Kind of the first one. Kind of try? Which would be a bummer.
thought I had it fixed. Turns out I did not. Feels like it shouldn't be this hard. Ugh! <sighs> 
I can make it happen. Like, I'm really liking this game. Like, this game, despite these controller issues, is actually. And this is more like Wii technology and like limitations of my setup rather than the game itself.
this might be. These more shoes. Like my hands actually like starting to hurt from this. Like I'm not gonna lie. My hand is legitimately hurting from this. From this uh motion control shit. It will literally only work. If I'm literally right here, how does this sound? I'm like, oh, it sounds terrible. It sounds horrible. <laughs> it looks terrible. Um, okay. I just need to double check something here. Uh, I want to make actually sure that I'm alive and well. It looks like I am, but one of my things says I'm dead. Okay. Yeah, everything's fine on the stream wise. So it's just saying that there's no one in the channel, which is fine. Let's see. Okay. Is it just because I'm not connected? Why is this? That's fine. I'm all the way over here. Now if I do this, right? If I do it like that. Wow, the lengths I have to go through to stream Resident Evil Fuck on 5. <sighs> kind of insane. There's a map, too. Hey! Oh, Oh, now is it not going to work?
where's everyone going? Bingo? Really? Is this guy just gonna make these cheesy funny jokes forever? Like, Jesus Christ. Honigate, I have, I have some, some bad news. news. I've confirmed, confirmed the body of an officer. officer. Something has happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Why, why is the voice acting so bad in this game right now? Oh, my Hello. Okay, when I first tried this game, there was a lot of uh, a lot of hand grenades. This bed is heavily stained. It seems as if no one slept in it for quite some time. But they're not zombies. I remember last time there was they claimed there was no zombies. Okay, I can push things. Good to know. Good to know. may be relevant to the later town. Good. We like red. I feel like there was. Find a big empty area. I want to beat the hell out of everything. I don't know. Why does this game give me chicken eggs? Why the fuck do I need chicken eggs for? It's 
this game all just the man, this man's long quest to make one gigantic omelet? Is that the Resident Evil? You just, uh... I also don't get why it's called Resident Evil. The weird title. have the incendiary. Uh, the thing I was looking for, I already have. Uh, hope everybody out there is having a good, fantastic day. Bullets. Is this game before or after? Before? Auto saves or after auto saves? I forget exactly when auto saves come. that village shit again. This game makes a point of telling me about this goddamn thing, so I'm gonna go get the goddamn thing. Goddamn it.
Actually, I wonder how to combine. Hello. Damn. Mixing it with the green herb will increase your maximum health. hurts like badly <laughs> too cold for this
that I'm moving along. Actually, like, advancing the story here. Turn this level all the way up to 100. Okay. Oh! Righty then. Righty then. Oh, righty then. Okay. Now we should be a little bit better. Given the uh, awkwardness of this setup right now. Did I need to go through there? I don't see where I would have gone, though. I must have missed something. So there's a typewriter. Sympathetic characters are usually villains. Interesting. I could see that. Like, like I could, I could see that. Yeah, like you kind of sympathize with the villain, got to get to know them a little bit more. You can understand where they're coming from. You may still think they're an evil bastard, but you can see where they're coming from. That mess. Let me wear that mess. Uh, welcome on in, Mick Maggot One Two Four. How you doing, man? You're not like them. No. You. Nice rings, bro. Okay. I have only one very important question. Do you got a smoke? Got gum. Perfect. The big cheese. What? Who is this guy? Oh! <laughs> Why did he think that was gonna work? <laughs> Oops! I actually just skipped the cutscene. I was trying to pause. <laughs> Yeah, I see where you're coming from. I definitely see where you're coming from here. I don't see where you're coming from here. I'm really sorry I missed that cutscene. I just wanted to laugh at how... Are Resident Evil games comedies? Because that was, like, cartoonishly funny. Was I supposed to take that seriously? Because that was cartoonish. Like, that was straight up, like, to something I would expect in, like, a Mario movie. Like, like Saints Row is where I would expect that exact cutscene there. Yeah. Feeble humans, let us give you our <laughs> power. 
He punches. You see it. <laughs> Just that you know, uh, magic. Uh, this is my very first Resident Evil game ever. Intoxicating power. <clears throat> so this is this is my first dive into this series. So if I'm uh, a little, hey, maybe like, hey, wake, wake up. up. Yeah, yeah. This is definitely a first, uh, first Girl, ever experience into more, this, into this franchise in general. You want to tell me what's going on here? I like it so far. Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Oh, hey, easy. Whoever you are. <sighs> Name's Leon. Came here looking for this girl. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Aren't I? You don't look the type. Maybe. I don't know okay, how many cops have an emo haircut. It's guess. bad for fighting. She's the president's daughter? <laughs> That's too good for a guess. Want to start explaining? Psychic powers. Nah, I was an ex-cop, yeah. With you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. That's a big ass axe. Oh! Yeah. That is all. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. But now okay. I'm just a good for nothing guy who happens to be quite a ladies' man. Why'd you quit? Phew, <laughs> policia. You put your life on the line. Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. Used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Demoy Amatai. Do something, cop! After you! Now! Sorry, I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was uh, a bit tied up. You're okay, right? Fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. This is what happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No. But apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm heading back to the oh. village. Oh, this is good. This is good. You know... I, I won't. I need to raise this here. My first ever experience with a Resident Evil game was back in 1997. I remember this because I was I was seven years old. I was trying to play with my friend Jake, and we were terrified of Resident Evil One. Terrified, like that opening scene we could get through, but. At one point in RE1, you find a zombie eating one of your friends, and when that zombie turned around, even with those PS1 graphics, made me and my friend Jake so scared we had to turn off the console. Wait, what? Oh. I forgot I could do that. So, that was my first ever... First experience, and I was a kid. My mind, you remember, I was seven. I was a child. I was a child. I am 32 now, and uh, oh man, it, these are horror games. This is supposed to be Spooktober on this channel. You know, I mean, I mean, Spooktober. This ain't no fucking spook. Over here, stranger. Who is this? 
is there just gonna is there it oh no way there is no way there is no way i i have i i i've beaten dead space so many times it's not scary i tried dead space 2 and dead space 2 is boring <laughs> Dead Space 2 is incredibly boring. I, did, I played Dead Space 2 yesterday. I got over halfway through the game, and I got bored of it. Like, Dead Space 2 is not a great game, apparently, for some reason. Dead Space 1, death's kiss, though. Dead Space 1, first playthrough, legitimately terrifying. Had to take pauses in that game the first time. But Dead Space 2, like, especially if you know how to do, like, the one-gun challenge from Dead Space 1, it, it's, it's just not scary. At least the second time around. You just know how to become too powerful in that game. But this is a good game. Like this is I am I am I am having fun. I am not gonna lie. Uh I watched a friend play three when it came out, and I, I know I'm not gonna like it. It I can see where the decline is in um, in Dead Space. They moved away from the horror aspects and leaned more into their run and gun mechanics that they had for that game, and it just kind of ruined it. Uh, oh god. I can, you know, now that I'm playing this game, I can see why all the Resident Evil movies suck. Like, this is not... Did I actually kill him? So, like, now that I've seen this, and this game, like, if this game is considered to be, like, peak RE by most people, I, have, I do actually have one friend uh, who thinks this is the worst Resident Evil game, period. I wouldn't say the worst Resident Evil game, but as he said, this is the one where they jump the shark. Okay, see, the, uh, I'm trying to do this with minimal tips. Typically, I'll say code pineapple. I'm not, like, I try to keep away from spoilers and let people and let myself kind of figure out the game out. Um, I don't even know what my fucking objective is right now, to be honest. But I'm not, like, that big on spoilers. If you give story spoilers, that's more what I'm mad about. Like, mechanic spoilers, I'm not, like, big on. Or, like, hey, this section's kind of bullshit. Like, do this. That I'm not big on. I'm not like my friend Tragic. Uh, who's, like, huge on, like, no spoilers of any kind. I'm not terribly big on that. Oh god. Oh, 
Okay, if you're not even supposed to, like, if you're not even supposed to do it, that's okay. See what you mean by there's a lot of fucking enemies. My but Jesus It's a small fucking army here. This is fucking ridiculous. Leon's kneecaps, to be honest. Go for the second half. Where am I supposed to go for this fucking second half? Yeah, see, I'm already out of like fucking bullets here. They're gonna make me combine them. Wait. Oh, it doesn't make quest items don't take away from inventory space. That's handy. Oh, Jesus, that's a little unfair. Come on, game. Okay. We got through. All right. Probably, probably time. Alright, I am having sensor bar issues, so if I'm aiming really badly, that's partially to blame. Partially, it's not the whole thing. I also am just trash. But 
this cutscenes, man. This is hilarious. It takes more than one shotgun blast to kill you. Why? What? I think I want to be on my handgun most of the time, right? Because like, the handgun seems like the main weapon, the shotgun seems like the, uh, the weapon you use in extreme circumstances. All else has failed. I know the rocket launch is like the big gun. Seems not easy, and I apologize for the audio issues that are going on tonight. I, uh, I have no way to avoid them. Are you... Are you kidding me? How many rounds are here? Oh my dear God! Do I have any health? Can I like? All right, so chicken eggs heal you. So this is the quest for the golden omelet! But uh, as I was saying before, um, I can see why all the RE movies are, like, really hokey. Because this is hokey. Like, if I made a movie off of this, I would make it hokey. Like, I have more respect for the RE movies now. Than I did before. Of course your movies are shit. Look at the source material you have. What you have now? Ammo. Dirty brass pocket ball. Alright, I 
did not have to do that. I got lucky there. I could see you being there for a little while with that. Check. You got the insignia key. Okay, insignia key. Open. More money. How much money do I fucking have? Does it say how much money I have? It. Oh. I have 30,000, almost 30,000 things of whatever the hell this is. Take, what am I taking here? Chief's note. As instructed by Lord Sadler, I have the agent in confinement alive. Why keep him alive? I do not fully understand what the Lord's attention are. I would, however, think he'd keep them separate, not confine them together as... As has been ordered. I don't expect Lewis would trust a, or trust a stranger, but if by chance they could cooperate, the situation could get a bit more complicated. If for some reason an unknown third party is involved, I don't think they'd let a chance like this slip by. But maybe it's all Lord uh, Sattler's ploy, leaving us vulnerable so the third party will surface if even... If they even exist, that is. It is unlikely. It is unlikely. It's an unlikely possibility. If a prowler is already amongst us, that our plans could be ruined. I guess the Lord thinks it's worth the risk if we're able to stop whatever conspiracy is at work. At any rate, it's all. It's the Lord's call. I will trust his judgment as always. Okay. You. There's all textbooks written in English, but I don't have any time to read. There's always time for a good book. Oh, well, RE4 is apparently a very short game. You carry the same blood as us, it seems. Nevertheless, you're an outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. What? Same blood. Oh, wow. It was short. Nice. Leon, I've been able to get some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Apparently, there's a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had an unexpected run-in with the big cheese of this village. But you're okay, right? Yeah. But he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. Carry the same blood. Huh. Interesting. Anyway, there are more important things than solving riddles right now. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. Is there more important things than solving riddles right now? Who 
you shooting at? Oh, hello. But who are you? And why are you in a very inappropriate dress for this situation? Like, very pretty, but very inappropriate dress for the situation. Take a brown chicken egg. Because of the motion control wouldn't, wouldn't take. I can only do two hours of this, otherwise, my hands are gonna hurt. Like, honestly, my hands are gonna hurt. Where's my shotgun on this bitch? I got a ruby. Oh, 
Oh my god. Wait, why am I back here? Am I supposed to be back here? I did that on a wild guess right there. Okay. Alright. We did an hour and a half of this today. We'll do more next week. Honestly, my hand is killing me. My hand is just... It's just killing me. It's just killing me. I cannot do very long on that game right now. And I can't do very long right now because of the pain I don't know what to do though. 